Miller Lite versus Send in Blue. Now, this video is going to be a quick comparison. I'm going to show you basically everything you need to know about these softwares so that you can make a good and informed decision about which one you are going to pick up. So, if you are interested in picking up either one of these email marketing softwares or potentially switching to one or the other, then keep watching as this is going to be the most valuable video you ever watch. Okay, so we are comparing these right here. And the first thing that I'm going to say is that Miller Lite and Send in Blue are the two best email marketing softwares on the market that I have found. Like no other company even comes close in terms of the user interface, the pricing, and overall, these are just the two best. Now, in my opinion, uh, one of these here is a clear winner, but um, yeah, let's first of all discuss the pricing because th there's a big difference right here. So we can go in and if we just take a look right here and we go with the marketing platform for Send in Blue, uh, well, both of these have free trials. Send in blue, free trial, so zero pounds, um, let me change this to dollars, zero dollars per month, and you can have unlimited contacts in this. Do you know how crazy that is? I've never seen in my entire life an email marketing software that allows you to have unlimited contacts with the free trial. It's crazy. Now, on top of that, um, you can send 300 emails a day for free, like you do not have to pay anything, and you can send out 300 emails to your list every day. That is for free, but that kind of like puts the limitations on. You can only send 300 emails a day. So if you have a email list of like 10,000 people, you're not really going to reach many of them by sending 300 emails, right? But with that being said, like Send in Blue still has a pretty fantastic trial because you can literally put your whole email list over and then just like select the 300 best performing or people who respond to your emails the most and basically try this out with them. Like you also get SMS and WhatsApp campaigns, drag and drop editor. So that is send in blue. And then for the free trial on Mail Lite, 12,000 monthly emails. So mm, my math is ridiculously bad guys, as you can probably tell. 12,000 divided by 30. Uh, so 400 emails a day. So you can actually send 100 more emails on Mail Lite, which is, which is a little bit better to be honest. Uh, but 1,000 subscribers is the most that you can have on your list. Now, as I say, like, yeah, you get unlimited contacts, which is pretty crazy with Send in Blue. Uh, but if you can only send 300 emails a day, mm, it kind of puts a limit on it, right? So I would say out of these two, they're both like pretty equal. Miller Send in Blue, you can get unlimited contacts. But with Miller Lite, you can send 100 extra emails per day. Uh, so as you can see already, guys, just from the free trial, there's, these are both like pretty fantastic softwares. And as I said, the best on the market for sure. Now, another thing that I haven't mentioned is Send in Blue. You can do like SMS and WhatsApp campaigns, but this isn't an option on Miller Lite. Like there's no SMS. So if you want to like combine SMS and email, then you have to go with Send in Blue anyway, because there's just not an option on Miller Lite. But from here, how do these pricing plans compare? So look, on Send in Blue, with every single plan, you get unlimited contact. Like there's not a set amount of contacts you can get or have on each plan. Each plan just comes down to how many emails you can send per day. So what I will do is just come down here and what actually guys, so which one would you go for? Starter or business? Mm, honestly, starter is probably better. Unless you need like marketing automation, advanced statistics, phone support. Honestly, when you're first starting out, the starter plan is going to be enough and it's way, way cheaper. So that is what I would recommend. Now with... Miller Lite, which one would you go for here? Once again, the cheaper plan is absolutely fine, growing business. As you get a little bit more advanced into your email marketing journey, maybe you will upgrade one day. Like you, you might get to the day and decide, hey, that's a feature that I now need to use. Upgrade at that point. At, at the start, I just recommend going for the cheapest version of both of these. So with that being said, let's go ahead and calculate how much it is actually going to cost in order to have both of these softwares. Let's say that you have um, a pretty decent size email list, not the biggest, of um, 5,000. So you can send unlimited monthly emails on Miller Lite. So look, that, that, is, that is the difference. With Miller Lite, you can send unlimited emails, but you're capped with how many subscribers you have. With Send in Blue, you can have as many subscribers as you like, but you're capped at the monthly emails. So it's a, yeah, it's a little bit strange, right? How we would even calculate this. So as I say, it, it really depends on what you need this for. Do you need more subscribers or do you need more emails? If you send out like under 10 emails per month to your list, then send in blue is definitely the way to go. 
because you can have as many subscribers as you like and a set certain amount of emails. But if you send like a bunch of emails, like if you send an email every day or an email every two days, then MailerLite is going to be better because of the prices are pretty similar. Like 40,000 emails per month you can send right here on Send in Blue with Unlimited. And MailerLite, 5,000 subscribers, 32 a month, and unlimited monthly emails. So just as like a, a random ballpark, guys, because this can be a little bit confusing, right? So let's say that you send out 10 emails per month. 10 emails per month is what you send out. And uh, you send this to a list of 5,000 people. So 10 times 5,000 is going to be, oh, whoopsie, 10 times 5,000, 50,000 emails per month. So... On MailerLite, you can send out 50,000 emails per month for 40, uh, $32. And on Send in Blue, it's going to cost you like $49 because you're going to have to bump this up. So as I say, it depends on how many emails you send out. So MailerLite is going to work out cheaper if you send a bunch of emails every month. If you only send a few to a big list, then definitely go with Send in Blue. That is what I would say. So that is the pricing. But now, which of these email marketing softwares is better and easier to use? Now, for me... Mm, I would say MailerLite by quite a distance. The interface is just so much nicer. Um, you can see right here, both of these are drag and drop tools, by the way. So if you want to try both of these out, then yeah, I recommend that. Yeah, that is a very, very smart move to make. But I would say the user interface and how easy it is to use MailerLite is better. MailerLite is the email software that I am using right now. I looked at Send in Blue for a while and... It was a close decision. As I said, these are two of the best email marketing softwares on the market. But for me, I just went with MailerLite because on the free trial, I found it so much nicer to use. Like if we just have a look at some of these templates, so beautiful. These are all of the templates that you can use and like edit. And on Send in Blue, uh, I'm not sure if you can see them, but f for me anywhere, I found that the templates were not as nice and I didn't really like them as much. So guys, uh, the final thing that I want to say is neither of these are bad. These are two fantastic email marketing softwares. I just think MailerLite has a slight edge in terms of price and the way the software is run, like the user interface, the templates and everything like that. Now, guys, if you are going to sign up for either of these softwares, either MailerLite or Send in Blue, all I ask is that you do so using the links down in the description. If you sign up using those links, I am going to earn a small kickback and it's kind of like a token of appreciation for if you enjoyed this video and it allows me to create more free valuable content just like this. But guys, that was a quick comparison between MailerLite and Send in Blue. Hopefully this helped you out and until next time guys, take it easy.